I was out here in the wilderness area, I figured I'd uh, do a short video and show you one of the awesome resources we have here in Arizona. This is something I do every year. I come out and I harvest a bunch of these. And uh, they are really good. I mean, we're talking awesome. See if I can grab one and show you what they look like inside. Probably a little trick I use when I'm harvesting. If I can get this to light in this wind, I don't know. This is the best way to harvest them. Burn all the stickers off of them first. Doesn't work very well in the wind, but it's working. This ain't hurting the plant none. Making it sweat a little bit. But if they get all these burned off of here. That's enough. There and take the old knife, my trusty old Swiss Army knife. And there you have it. I usually peel the skin off. That's how you harvest prickly pear. And like I said, usually once a year I'll come out here and I'll collect a whole bucket of them. What I do is I take them home and make them up into juice. And I either can it or freeze it. When you get done doing that, any time of the year you can thaw it out and use it. Drink it makes excellent drinking juice and as you can tell look how red they are they're definitely got look at that <laughs> and here's the big pitfall which a lot of people don't like they're full of seeds I don't know if you can see them but flavor-wise, oh, they're awesome. Sweet. Usually what I do is I chew them and suck the juice out. out and I just spit the seeds. And they 
taste delicious. A few people only knew. You people out in the desert that don't go out and harvest these, you just don't know what you're missing. These are some of the best wild desert fruit around. And usually about, oh, late August into October is when you harvest them. Right before it starts getting cold again. If you look out across there, some of those don't have any on them, but some do. But They're scattered in places like this. They're all up and down this road. This one here I just stopped because it had quite a few on it. I wanted to show it to you. But I just thought I would share that little bit of knowledge with you. Awesome fruit. You don't know what you're missing. Yummy, yummy. A little messy. But I don't mind. What they taste. They're delicious. And there you have it. Prickly pear cactus. Nature's ultimate fruit in the desert. I hope you enjoyed that.